Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So we will be reviewing a new gaming mousepad called G2 from Gtoper, which is a new brand for PC gaming gears. So without further ado, let's go check it out. Okay, so this is the G2 Mousepad XL version. As you can see, my copy is pretty beat up due to shipping, but at least the mousepad itself is okay. You can check out the details and specs of this mousepad on the packaging. The base is very interesting. It's like the base of my HyperX gaming mousepad before. It's an alpha cell base pattern that sticks pretty well on top of my desk mat and it's even better if you place it on your desk without a desk mat. You don't have to worry if you are an aggressive or a low sense gamer, this pad won't go anywhere. The surface is a wooden fine polyhybrid material with a thickness of 3.5mm and I can definitely say that this is a control pad with a strong stopping power but glides quite smoothly and also this mouse pad is uncoated so expect pure performance. As you can see, the stitching is nicely done but there's just a sort of unstitched or worn out parts maybe because this is a pre-production copy and that's understandable in my opinion. And this pad is very firm, not soft nor hard. Since the surface is a bit rough which I mentioned a while ago, this is very normal to all control pads out there. It's better to wear an arm sleeve so that it will be more comfortable while gaming and it helps you glide better during long swipes or flicks. This will also prevent rash or skin irritation on your forearm. Stopping power is also noticeable on micro movements so this means that using this pad will give you more precision and accuracy. Control pads are one of the best choice for any kind of FPS gaming whether it's fast or slow face like Valorant or Overwatch, this pad is just perfect for both type of FPS games. For now, my only suggestion is for the printing. Gitoper can just make a minimalist print, just place a logo or remove the word mousepad on this because everybody knows it's a mousepad anyway. So yes, that's it. Overall, in my opinion, this mousepad is a solid control pad. Knowing that this is their very first gaming mousepad, I think this will do well in the market and with more color options, this will be very very interesting gaming mousepad. And for a sub $30 price category, I say everyone should give this mousepad a try. It's really that good for the price and a bang for the buck for its performance. So there you go, thank you Gitover for sending this for review. Please follow them on Twitter and check their website. I'll see you on the next one. Subscribe if you find this video helpful. Hit the like and leave a comment. As always, GG.